Hello friends, this is Lady Flora and I thought it would be fun today to talk about uh, a wild edible in Florida that you may not have expected. I hope the noise isn't too loud. Everybody is mowing their lawn today, right now. All three of our neighbors are mowing their lawn and my husband's mowing the lawn as well. So it's a lawn mowing party. But yeah, I thought we would talk about the conch shell. This is the, um, the shell of probably a queen conch. And um, the story goes that my mom has three conch shells and one of them supposedly my dad plucked from the Gulf of Mexico, but we don't know which one. <laughs> I don't think it's this one because I found the remnants of a price tag um, in there somewhere, but, but yeah, conch shells are just, um, snails, edible snails, <laughs> and apparently some people do eat it raw, um, but it's also cooked, and, uh, it's pretty common in the Bahamas and in the Caribbean, uh, but in Florida, it's been, um, uh, it's been outlawed, like, you can't fish for conch because it's been overfished and because it takes a very long time um, for a queen conch to get this big uh, so so yeah it's just um, it's no longer legal to, to fish these as far as I know it's I believe it started in the 80s um, that was kind of when it happened and as you can see this one has kind of the the points have been sort of um, removed, which is interesting. Uh, looks like removed by a person, not necessarily by the natural elements. Um, but yeah, they're just really incredible shells that I always associate with Florida and the mysteries of the deep. And um, I think I mentioned this before, I've never actually eaten conch before, so I have no idea what it tastes like. <laughs> Um, but I'm not a huge fan of the, um, shellfish food group. <laughs> but yeah, I thought I would share that, and, uh, it's pretty exciting that these, um, giant creatures exist, um, in the ocean, in the gulf, and they're just moving along and living their lives and escaping from predators and, uh, growing huge. <laughs> So yeah, I make a vlog about five times a week because I believe that going outside and connecting with nature can have a positive impact on your life. So if you're new, I would love to have you subscribe, comment, like, share, and you can also follow me on Instagram, Lady Flora Instagram. Um, I haven't posted anything on there recently, but uh, I do have some cool things posted on there that are kind of fun. So. After you do that, go outside and have a sublime day. <laughs>